Grange Hill actor Nicholas Donnelly, who played teacher Mr. Mackenzie in the much-loved children's show, has died at the age of 83. The actor, who played the role for around eight years, died in his sleep at the weekend and had not been ill, his family have said. A statement paying tribute to Mr. Donnelly on Monday described him as marvelous company and a privilege to know. His family said, he was a gracious, kind, and lovely man, a wonderful father and grandfather. He was also very funny and brilliant at telling stories, acting out all the characters, marvelous company, and a privilege to know. He loved nothing more than offering hospitality and making people feel welcome. Mr. Donnelly also appeared in BBC police series Dixon of Doc Green as Sergeant Johnny Wills in around 200 episodes of the show, which starred Jack Warner in the title role as George Dixon. In 2015, he was quoted as saying to the Daily Express, Many of my scenes were with Jack Warner, who played Dixon, particularly as his right-hand man with a fast pair of legs, whenever we had to chase a load of crooks. The producers allowed me to progress through the ranks to acting sergeant, sergeant, and even dog handler. He also told the newspaper, Jack was kind to everyone and very professional. He made the show a huge success and we were like a family because of him. We always had an end-of-season party, and as soon as Jack walked in the room you noticed him. It was his charisma, you can't define it, buy it or learn it, but he had it. Warner's character's greeting of evening all and good night all became a staple of the program. Mr. Donnelly met his wife all run during his national service in Germany in the late 1950s, and the couple were married for more than 60 years. They had two sons, twin daughters, and five grandchildren. The actor, who was a Queen's Park Rangers fan, grew up in Kensington, West London, and his other TV credits included appearances in The Saint, which starred Roger Moore. His acting also extended to the big screen, where he starred in films like 1982 horror film Venom and comedy film Carry On Sergeant. In 1993, he retired to Hastings with his wife, where he was a lay minister at his Catholic church, St. Mary Star of the Sea. His death comes days after Grange Hill creator Phil Redmond is set to turn the now-defunct hit children's TV series into a film, it has been revealed. The 72-year-old TV producer and screenwriter, who was also behind Brookside and Hollyoaks, has reportedly just completed the script for a film based around the children's program set in a school.